Okay, uh, hi, this is Turd here, and this is just a basic tutorial, um, just on making kind of like a grass scene with like hills and stuff. Uh, it's not going to be too complicated, it's just going to be using particles and stuff. Okay, so delete the default cube by pressing delete, and okay. Then you want to add a plane, so spacebar, add mesh plane. Okay, and then you just want to size it out to about, not too big, just like that. And then you um, would probably want to uh, maybe give it a texture. Uh, I'm just going to color it like uh, green, just for grass, just like that. And uh, while we while we do this, I'm just gonna add another plane. So uh, add mesh plane, and size it to about the same size, and put it just a little bit below it. And uh, now I'm just gonna make this brown. It's gonna be like the hills underneath it, just like that. Okay. Now I'll go back to the first, the green plane, which is the grass, or gonna be the grass. Okay. Now you want to go to the object tab, go over to particle buttons right here, and add new, right there. Okay, now where it says emitter, we want hair, so go up to hair, and set the amount a little bit higher to like 12 or 1600, and you want to put the normal up a bit, and you can, you can see it's emitting right there, and the random just makes it more random. You might want to put the amount up a little bit more. And the random up. I have it about 230 and 110. And the particles about 2500. Or make it about 3000. Okay. And now we want to go back to the other plane and hit tab to go into edit mode and uh, just uh, subdivide it a whole bunch of times so hit W subdivide into uh, just a bunch of times okay now we're gonna uh, just like uh, sculpt this kind of uh, go to this go to uh, sculpt mode right there now you have your sculpt tool and I'm just gonna go to the properties which are in the editing tab and uh, under sculpt you can grab it and put the size up so go to grab and put the size up and you can just grab it through here it's underneath and make like hills kind of just like that drag it up and uh, you can use these other tools there's inflate which you can just put it over a part of it and it'll just inflate it might want to put the strength up and everything see it'll just kind of inflate it and smooth will just smooth it out it's not a very good example but okay once you have your hills there you want to go into object mode so go to object mode and you want to set smooth because it's still not smooth and uh, make sure the light is above it and uh, view your camera render it to see what happens and uh, you just have to play around with that to get the right settings you want so I would probably put more grass into that it's a little bit plain right now um, I'll just do that now. So I'm just going back into the object uh, tab and putting up the amount a little bit. And maybe put the normal down. And I'm just going to render this but pause the video. Okay, uh, that looks a little bit better. Uh, so yeah you might want to change that and now we're just gonna give the plane 
or the hill part, the ground, uh, a texture. Okay. So go to that and select the ground plane and go to the material or shading tab and go to the texture buttons add new then where it says none go to clouds and put the noise size down to like 60 about and go to map input or go back to the material buttons and go to map input over here then you want to set that to object and map to you want this color to be a brown color too so like that and to put up the normals select norm or nor and uh, drag this up you might not want that much but let's just see this so that's looking okay and for the last thing I'm just gonna add like a rock or rocks so uh, click somewhere to center the cursor or not center just put it right there and now hit the spacebar add mesh uh, UV sphere and you don't need that much it's just a rock so put it down to like that okay go up to this and size it down and uh, you might want to set smooth also uh, you might want to sculpt it kind of so go into edit mode by pressing tab and go to sculpt mode and go down to sculpt and grab it and you can just shape it however you want Inflate until you kind of got a rock kind of shape. Now go uh, back into object mode, and now we're just going to give this a simple texture. Go into shading tabs, add new, like a grayish color. Then go into the material tab, add new and set it to clouds again and put it at like a hundred right there and map to object again and set this color in map to or right here to uh, like dark gray then nor turn it up like halfway um, that's pretty much good you might want to make a couple of them just to see it better or to have more of a scene so uh, when you have it selected press alt D and the right mouse button to bring it back move it around with the arrows or by hitting G to grab it and you can size these down to make it look like it's a different rock and size it up okay uh, oh wait one more thing you can add a just a different background kind of color so it doesn't look like that oh wait so go to uh, the world tab right here then go to this color put it at like a light blue and you might want to blend it with a darker blue so click blend and then set it to a different blue kind of over on this color panel thing and the first one should be a little bit lighter okay now render it I'm just gonna pause this so uh... that looks okay i think it's pretty good for a basic grass hill scene um... and that's how you make that thanks for watching us